Hey everybody, this is uh, Mankato Brew IQ uh, back. I have a special treat today. Uh, today is April 1st, April Fool's Day, and this is no April Fool's joke. Um, brand new released, uh, two local companies in Mankato <clears throat> came out with, uh, basically came together. Uh, one, Nash, nationally uh, known, uh, Angie's... Uh, Kettle Corn, or now known as Boom Chicka Pop, um, and the Mank Kettle Brewery, as uh, we know. Um, never had this beer. Um, just bought it today, a couple hours, put it in the fridge, let it chill down. Um, this is it. Uh, Boom Chicka Pop Popcorn Ale. Um, curious. I mean, it has the Angie's logo. And then the Mankato Brewery logo. Um, it's interesting. Um, basically, it says the story. Angie's Boom Chicka Pop and Mankato Brewery put their heads and their ingredients together to make Boom Chicka Pop Farmhouse Ale Brewed. You guessed it, Boom Chicka Pop Popcorn. Um, when the snow thaws and the first crocus bloom, I have no idea what that is. Uh, Minnesotans can't wait to get outdoors, and trust me, we're outdoors a lot, and uh, 30 degrees, 10 degrees, negative 20 degrees, uh, we love the outdoors, so once it warms up a little bit, it's a little bit better, but... Uh, we brewed this light, refreshing craft beer to welcome the spring and celebrate summer. We even put it in a can so you can pop it open at the lake, the game, or your own backyard. So, this is a Belgian-style farmhouse popcorn ale craft beer brewed with Angie's non-GMO popcorn, barley, oats, hops, yeast, and pure Minnesota water. Land of 10,000 lakes. Um, yeah, so it's uh, it's a 5% alcohol, and uh, the IBU is a 24. Um, 16 ounce cans, you get four of them. Uh, right now, I bought it uh, seven fifty. dollars uh, Looks like the regular price is going to be around eight fifty, but uh, they had a $1 sale, I'm guessing release-wise. Again... It is not April Fool's. I'm really, really excited to try this beer. Never had it before. Um, even the bag, I mean, it looks just like the bag. It's so freaking amazing. <clears throat> um, trust me. Uh, it's, uh, I don't know. It's going to be interesting. Uh, some people I've talked to about it are kind of like, yeah, they don't know. But then again... Um, me, and like you guys, I don't know, probably aren't true, uh, craft beer drinkers. We'll drink anything from a very light to a very dark. Um, flavor-wise, I've tried everything, and this is just something that's so stunning. And to come out from, uh, Mankato, and, uh, come from Angie's and Mankato Brewery getting together, this is something really special. And, uh... Even if I don't like it personally, which I hope I do, I hope this stays around um, every spring, summer. This would be a great addition uh, to the come look for. It's, I mean, I'd say it's about half their pumpkin grinder. <sighs> this would be an amazing six month from, you know, October to now. So pop, pumpkin grinder to popcorn beer. I think that'd be excellent every spring. Hopefully this spring they bring this out. Um, we're gonna crack it open. We're gonna hear the pop. Nice pop. Um, smell wise, it smells like a normal ale. Um, I could maybe smell a little type of. Uh, Restaurant popcorn type uh, type deal, you know, get a little ale. Uh, color wise, a 
golden. It's pretty much a golden color. Um, translucent. I mean, I don't want to say this, but it, it looks like butter. Um, it smells. It smells like fresh craft beer. And you can really smell the grains and the hops and here we go. Uh first taste of the Mank Cato Breweries and Angie's Boom Chicka Pop. Oh yeah. You can definitely uh you can taste popcorn in that. Um and it goes down, it's smooth. Um, wow. That, that is actually amazing. Um, cause it's not over, it's not over pushing popcorn, but it definitely, when it's in your throat and you can definitely, I'm shocked. I do not know how how to explain it, but it's definitely in the back of my throat there. That little corn, popcorn, it's nothing salty, it's not sweet, but it's more like that aftertaste of uh, having popcorn, you swallow, almost like pushing popcorn onto the roof of your mouth, just that kind of aroma. This is an excellent beer guys oh my god um i would recommend getting some asap um hopefully this would be god hopefully this stays till october um <laughs> this might be a new favorite beer you guys are gonna sell out of this very very quick uh wow i am shocked uh out of my 10 10 stars uh nine nine and a half nine and three quarters i mean i could probably give this a 10 but i don't know what else could top it um heck i'm gonna give it a 10 stars um outstanding really really shocked but this is an amazing beer guys mankato brewery angie's you guys have a hit mankato brew iq signing out this is episode four We'll come back. Um, see you next time.